Daniel, obviously a chance to right here close it out um, tonight with a sweep, but that didn't happen. Where do you think is the biggest dis the biggest disconnect um, when it comes to tonight's game? Hmm. I really can't put my finger on it. You know, I felt like we fought all the way to the end. We just missed a couple of shots at the end. There were some great looks. We got the looks that we wanted. They just didn't fall for us. Daniel, um, I wanted to ask you about just Anthony Edwards coming out for them and kind of leading them as a, you know, a young guy. What do you think about his performance tonight? I mean, he came out with energy. You really can't put too many words to that. He came out ready to play. Uh, Dan, you've been playing with Derek, obviously, uh, most of the year. First of, first off, how good has he been, and how did you guys have to try to adjust without him tonight? Um, I mean, Derek has been great. He's came out ready to play night in, night out. He's been picking up the slack with me, of course, because last couple of games I haven't been really ready to play, I feel like. You know, I'm letting the team down in a lot of areas, and he really helps me motivate myself because, you know, as hard as he's working, I want to be able to do the same thing, so I got to be better for him. Um, but, you know, all honesty, you know, we just have to have that next man up mentality and just be able to kind of, like, withstand that punch that they're trying to throw at us. Daniel, when Luca was up here, he said that he himself had a little bit of a lack of energy tonight. Would you say that that was something among the team, or was that just an assessment that Luca made for himself? It might have been 50-50, I would say. You know, I really can't talk for everybody else. I know for a fact that I didn't come out ready to play at all. My energy was low, and I had to really just kind of, you know, dig deep, kind of like pull just some type of energy out just to be able to kind of come out and just play basketball at the end of the day. You know, those guys weren't going to go down easy, and they came out tonight and they hit us in the mouth, and we had to adjust to it. Hmm? Yeah. Um, I wanted to ask you one more thing. So you said you felt like you kind of let the team down. Um, I know, like, you're a hard worker. That's going to motivate you going into game five, isn't it? Oh, yeah, most definitely. You know, yeah, I mean, this, this one hurts. We was expecting to be happy at the end of the game, and now we're pissed off.